How has the past year been for Gaming Malta? What have you been up to? Well, the past year has been has been very busy for us. Um, uh, obviously, Malta as a jurisdiction has been uh, very operational for the past 10 years. And we have been working with local operators in terms of, you know, uh, strengthening the ecosystem which we have on the island. And we've also been working on, uh, on other new areas such as uh, daily fantasy sports, uh, esports and other sectors. I mean, Malta has become the success it is today, not only from its reputation as a, as a reputable licensing jurisdiction, but as a location where operators can easily locate their um, uh, collaborate together, find the necessary resources, and we work very closely with them to make sure that we can make their stay in Malta a good one. And tell me about the year ahead. What are you looking to achieve in 2018? Sure. The year ahead is obviously very important for us. It is again working with operators to make sure that they continue to remain, working with the authority to attract new operators to the island, but then more important is looking at new sectors, looking at video gaming, and trying to create linkages with the other new sectors which are developing with the iGaming industry.